Hey family, happy Tuesdays. I'm Herbless Viola, so we're doing Tuesdays with Very Wise Alternatives, answering the subscriber questions. Look, before we get started, like, share, and subscribe so you won't miss the next video. I just want to clarify some things that I said about your gallbladder and what you should do after you, you, know, you lose your gallbladder. Look, I know I said eat five small meals. Look, that's just entirely too much. Look. We're, we're pretty much eating too much. And that's the, probably the main reason why we lost our gallbladder. I know I've said that a lot of times, but the truth is we are eating too much. Your body actually need a rest. Your body actually need a rest. And that's the main cause of all our issues is what we put in our mouth. So look, I'm not going to get too much into it, but I wanted to clarify. If you do not have your gallbladder, look, don't eat five meals a day, you know? If you can do two meals or one meal, that is perfect. We're eating too much and our body just needs to rest. Yes, you got a little faucet in there that's just dripping, that bowel's just dripping. Make sure you take the digestive enzyme. So sometimes you find yourself waiting six to seven hours to eat. It's fine. It's fine. It's probably the best thing. Another subscriber, they ask about well, a couple of people want to, wanted to know like step by step what's the fasting process and what's the business of fasting. And I just want to make sure y'all guys understand and listen. So it's several, several different days that I actually went on. It's like I make a three to four day process. I went over fasting. So I just want you to listen to it. Just a little snip. I just want to put a little bit on my video. I'm going to tell you the true reason why y'all need to fast, the true reason that, let me close the door, that I really want you guys to actually think about fasting and to do the whole detox. Because look, y'all need to be disconnected to this, disconnected from this world, meaning all this worldly crap, all this food that we shouldn't be eating. Come on, let's be honest. Let's be honest. If y'all look at the videos and research and stuff I've been researching with all these different chemicals, GMO, and look at the day. The true, true re reason why you're fasting. You know, that's the true healing. If y'all don't understand all these things we're going through, all this stuff that, you know, we have in our body, truthfully, you need to do this fast because it's best for you. Look, Hourly benefits of fasting. So Go over with fasting. I just want to get more in depth and speak with you guys on a pretty much on a just on a deeper level so you guys can understand fasting. Remember that word I couldn't pronounce, but look, it's autophagy. And that is something that's so critical and so important in our lives, and we just keep missing it because we want our bodies to go in and get to a state that it's recycling now understand me it's recycling uh different and important nutrients back in our body the the cells back in our body is actually going to uh stem cells regeneration i know people like no it doesn't because we haven't really been to that state and this is so important that we get to that state. I mean, get to the state. That means going, uh, having a fast three days. And we're talking about just water alone. Yes, you heard me. Water alone. Just drinking water and look at you. Because look, like I already told you, the state I was going through. You know, but the fasting I was doing, I was doing a, a fast, but I was doing a cleanse as well. That's why I was taking herbs. But the fast I want you to go on is a fast to where you're just drinking water only. And we're talking about people that's sick. I'm not talking about you healthy people that just maybe got a stomach bug and it's just them parasites, killing them parasites. But we're talking about something going on a deeper level, going beyond, you know, going back into space, really going back deep inside of your brain where the space is. Let's just be honest. Let's start, start looking up. Let's not look up. Look in within. Please look within. And we're talking about going back deep, deep into your mind, deep into your heart, deep into your bone marrow. Let's <laughs> I'm just telling you, we want to go deep and we want to go in there and we want to clean everything out, especially them autoimmune crap that they keep putting labels on. These other things that's going on in our body, yes, I'm going to talk about cancer a little bit, but I just want to just get to my people who's just sick and tired, sick and tired of sick and tired. 
And same thing with people that need to lose that weight. If you really want to lose that weight, we're going to talk about that too. But I'm talking about doing some fasting. The same thing that you do in a hospital. And you're wondering why you're feeling good because you're fast. Your behind was in the hospital. You was forced because you was listening to the doctor because you don't want to listen to us herbalists. Yeah, I said it. I know you were like, dang, I don't care. Be mad at me. I don't care. But I'm trying to save you. I'm trying to save your health. I'm trying to get your health back. Trying to tell you what you need to look at because they're not going to tell you. Well, some people are not going to tell you because it's not beneficial. The money is <laughs> a money issue. Oh, I can't believe I said that, but I said it. But it's a money issue. You're not making the money. They don't want healthy people. Ain't no health. They don't want the healthy people. And it's the beauty of fasting. It's just simply drinking water. Simply drinking something that y'all don't want to drink. Oh, I don't want to drink no water. I'm sick of water. I'm so tired of hearing Viola say drink water. I'm tired of it. Yeah, I'm gonna get tired of it. It it, it save your it save your 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 heart. It will save them kidneys. It will get that that your adrenal glands going like it's supposed to, and it will get those kidneys and get that liver right. Come on. Yeah, the her herbs gonna assist you because there's a lot of people that just got to eat. You just you feel like you got to eat. No, if like I said, like you know, Herbis Cream said it years ago. We eat too damn much. I be wondering how I lost that twenty two pounds that fast. That is how. That is how I fast. I listen to my brother and fast is fasting. I'm trying to tell you, I better go back to fasting. I'm like, I can't do it. I got this job. All right, you got that job. You got that job, and that job's gonna put you in that grave faster. It's gonna keep you one tiptoe at the hospital, one tiptoe at the doctor. You're gonna be going in between talking, doctor, help me, doctor, help me. And all you gotta do is fast. Because you know, when your body wear out and you pass out on that ground, you wake up, you're gonna be in a hospital hooked up to that IV. That's nothing but a little salt, a pinch of salt. Same thing I'm trying to tell you, do at home. Get that water, and I'm trying to tell you, get that water, get that water. But you guys, the beauty in fasting, whether you could just do it for one day, and I mean one day, and don't just go the next day and trip out and say, oh, I'm going to eat all this. No, get down to eating like maybe one meal a day, if not two. But the critical thing in there is make sure it's like hours in between. So if you got to eat by one o'clock in the afternoon, make sure your next meal's not to seven or eight. I know that's late. That's why you got to back it up. Eat at seven, next meal, eat at three. Make sure it's in between. And no snacking in between. You feel hungry, go drink some water. Put a little pinch of Himalaya salt. Yes, I said a pinch of Himalaya salt and you're going to be all right. And then on occasion, go take your Epsom salt bath. Get that, get your body back right. Because, like, I know you're going to feel dizzy. I know you're going to feel hungry. I know you're going to get a headache. Pinch of Himalaya salt. Sit down there and meditate. I keep telling about them free doctors go hug a tree. Yeah, I'm going to do a little short video on this, but not too long. But I just need you guys to understand. If you really want to lose that weight, eat. Make sure it's seven to eight hours in between. And if you got a snack, oh, my goodness, I don't even want to say this. You got a snack. Eat a pear. Just one pear. Just eat a pear. All right, family. So I'm going to end there. Yes. <laughs> if y'all want, go listen to the podcast. Yes, I be clowning, but y'all know I'm speaking the truth. If y'all want, go ahead and research it. But I'm going to end there. Look, happy Tuesday, family. You guys have a great day. <laughs> I'm Herbless Viola. <laughs> Bye.